First responders have long used the drug naloxone to reverse the effects of an opioid overdose. It's almost a turnaround within a minute of somebody being unconscious, not breathing, to awake and talking to us normally, questioning what, what exactly happened. But now anyone can buy the drug, commonly called Narcan, without doctor's orders. We have a standing order for it, so we don't need a prescription from a doctor. We actually this acts as the prescription. Governor Terry McAuliffe put that in place one month ago when he declared the opioid crisis a public health emergency. I think it provides access um, to people who might not normally have access to something that could save their life. The drug costs about $165 for two doses, but most insurance companies will pay for it. CVS and Walgreens pharmacies in Central Virginia also carry Narcan, but it's not only in national chains. People don't even have to present a prescription. We can just use the state's prescription. John Plants owns Timberlake's Pharmacy on Charlottesville's downtown mall. He's been a pharmacist since 1969. No, I've never seen anything where we could give prescription medication out without a prescription in our hands. He says nobody has bought it yet, but they've only had it on the shelves for a few weeks since that order came out. Just, we didn't stock it. I mean, we didn't know we should be stocking it until the state kind of commanded us to do so. Narcan isn't dangerous in the hands of an untrained bystander. It has no side effects if administered to someone who actually isn't experiencing an opioid overdose. It's almost like a, uh, why wouldn't you use it if it's not going to hurt them? And as the number of opioid overdoses in Central Virginia is still on the rise, first responders often use Narcan to save lives. If you give it to them, there's really no, nothing but benefit. Nora Noose, NBC 29 HD News.